To create Libertaria, the virtual opera, I used an animation style called Machinima. Unlike traditional animation, where an animator draws a film frame by frame by frame, either by hand or using a computer, in Machinima, the characters move in a preset virtual world and the director records them using cameras, like a live production. As video game developer Mike Kelly says, Machinima is a video game with the game removed. In Machinima, you control the characters and tell them how to move, what to say, and where to go with a few clicks of the mouse. Using the Machinima software Movie Storm, the animation team quickly created complex sets, dropping in customized characters and directing them with commands like an actor on the live stage. The intuitive software, low cost, and quick results are only some of the reasons why I was able to produce a feature-length animated opera for less than $1,000. Since the premiere at South Florida's Concerts at Calvary series, hosted by Dr. Clara Shore, Libertaria the Virtual Opera has been screened live and online by thousands at venues like the Holland Animation Film Festival, MovieStorm.com, TEDx Buffalo, music festivals and universities, and on websites like YouTube and Vandalism. Wanting to open source the opera, I encourage pirates to download my film, resulting in more guerrilla film distribution. Libertaria the Virtual Opera can be enjoyed by anyone with an internet connection. With Libertaria, the audience experiences the opera on their own terms. They can watch it on the big screen, on TV, on a laptop or smartphone. They can comment on YouTube, download the film, watch a favorite song over and over again, share clips with friends through social media, or even make their own mashup. You don't need to wear a tie or buy expensive tickets to enjoy Libertaria. Libertaria is the opera you can watch in your pajamas.